Hey guys, Craig here, welcome back to more Super Mario Galaxy 2. In the previous episode, we can continued on our adventure in World 2 and got pretty far. So we started off back here and we finished both of these worlds, then moved on and got the star up here with the Colmel. And today we're going to be moving on to the Cosmic Cove Galaxy to hopefully get the final two stars plus a common male in this area. So let's go right into the Twin Tolls, Twin Falls Hideaway to try to find where the next star is. And I actually think this world is pretty interesting because it has a new mechanic. Which is, well I'm not going to spoil it yet. Well actually no we haven't even went swimming yet have we in this game. So well uh, there's a few new mechanics actually in this area. So first one is swimming. And a pro. I'm not, I'm not. I'm honestly not going to say that much more. But okay. Um, a tip is for swimming. It well, the things about swimming is, first of all, you swim like this. But as you can see, it's pretty slow. Um, and then you can spin like I'm doing right here to go faster. Um, if you play as Luigi in Mario Galaxy, um, you actually lose air by swimming. And also, the final thing to note about this is the fact that you can pick up a shell as well do this. So yeah, just be aware if you're going to play as Luigi in Super Mario Galaxy. Is he in Super Mario Galaxy 2? Not even going to spoil that. But all I'm going to say is he might be. Might be. <laughs> but that's also a tip for anyone who's playing as Luigi in Super Mario Galaxy 1. But <laughs> that's the only thing I'm going to say. He's in Super Mario Galaxy 1. Is he in Super Mario Galaxy 2? You'll just have to wait and find out until the, until it's here at the end of the episode. Uh, and let's play. I'm like, ha, trolled. Oh, oh shit, but it's over there. So I have to go. Crap. Ha. <laughs> or else it's the part where we unlock Luigi. And it's like, oh, Luigi is in this game, by the way. Hmm. Maybe we'll find out sooner than you think. Maybe. <laughs> but okay, we're going to be moving on. And... This is, there's a second mechanic about this level, which you will see in just a second. Once we get up here, there is a giant red button, and here we go, use this, and it freezes the world. There's also a co hungry coin luma that you wants 50 coins, if I'm not mistaken. Ow. Well, I'm not sure why I'm saying ow. They should be saying ow. 15? Oh, only 15? I thought to myself, okay, I'm just doing really piss bad at this. But yeah, obviously I'm not going to be doing that for this level because look how many coins and all I missed out. Oh, it's, on, it's actually on the surface. Wow, holy crap. They've really, we've really screwed over those. Got cheap cheeps and all, let me see. Aw, oh, I was hoping maybe we could get coins from each one of them if we jumped on I think actually, no, all we could do is we... And look at this, I'm finding new things out about this level, which I didn't know before. Brilliant. It's always that, it's always- Okay, we only got two more, no, all we can do is- this, this is our challenge now, can we get two more coins? Or have we screwed ourselves by two coins? Put your bets in the comment section below. And if you know, stop being a dirty cheater. <laughs> I think actually, you know, I think we have screwed ourselves, so. Meh. Let's go. Is this actually the end of the level? Up there? Is this actually- If this is honestly the end of the level, holy crap, this is ten times quicker than I thought it would have been. I know this is taking us a wee while, but obviously I'm not rushing this let's play at all, so... I'm going to just take a wee- Holy moly. This is like a Super Mario 64 length level? Jeepers. Five minutes into the recording- Four and a half minutes into the recording even, 3D. And we're- Oh, I got a star, and I was pissing around this level for a long time. All I'm gonna say is that's an easy, <laughs> easy star. Well, obviously it's the next star which I know about. So okay, now we've got one new star. So now are we up? We're already up to twenty. We're sick of the way through the main part of the game. That is good. <laughs> and now we've got another way to get to the. To the boss of the level. Oh come on, you know I think but how am I gonna waste this might be a shorter episode of the monster because actually no no what now I think but there's at least two more stars to do in cosmic than that hungry luma. 
It might be slightly shorter, but it's not going to be as short as I thought it was going to be, like 10 minutes long. No. There's no worries about that. But yeah, I do end off the episode once we have reached the, um, the World 2 castle because, you know, I don't want to. I don't want to basically, you know, ruin everything. But what am I even talking about? I don't want to move on that part because honestly, that's. Obviously, that's one of the bigger plot parts, and that's something you want to start an episode so people don't miss out. That's what I am trying to say. Also, hold in like the crouch button, and you can skip backwards, which is honestly a very fun thing to do. And this, well, it's not really recommended, and it's not needed, but it's a fun thing to do nonetheless. But yeah, as you can have guessed by you know the thing, this is going to be the big part about this level. Um, the 2 2D section here, which is something I actually didn't have in really in the original galaxy, is the 2D sections. So basically, we've got a 2D platformer here on a 3D game. <laughs> Super Mario. This is, um, a f I wonder if this is like the inspiration stuff for like Super Mario 3D Land, like this kind of stuff. Well, I do not think, but Super Mario 3D Land is still like basically a 3D game, only if. Just all the 2D elements. But you cannot... As good as like Super Mario 3D World and all is, you cannot beat this game. Well, the, this style of game where it's like fully 3D and it's like full like... There's like many stories and all to each world and everything has, you know, an atmosphere to it and all. And like the characters have person... There's characters and all to talk to. Like the Piantas from Super Mario Sunshine and... The like Lumas of penguins and all those. There's, you can't beat that. And like you know the, the bombs from Super Mario 64. You cannot beat all of this in my opinion. And it's so good. But and I'm really sad that I haven't got another one of these. But I do think whenever the NX comes out, they will be going back to this style. Even though they have like went around like basically showed that I prefer the other one. Other style because it's it's obviously an easier game to make because there's not as much personality because for them that's actually probably an advantage and people love that those games so I could actually I I can see it going both ways but honestly like Super Mario Sun Super Mario Galaxy had like two two versions of it like for Super Mario Galaxy one and two and now there's basically been Super Mario 3D Land two so I can't really see another one of them happening. But it wouldn't surprise me if there was one. But like, I would like it if I go back to like, older ones. I'm not like since my 64 2 because I don't, well obviously I won't have them because what a weird name that would be. <laughs> oh god, no, 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 no! That worked, I'm live! <laughs> um, obviously it won't be called like Mario 64 2 because that would not make any sense. At all because obviously it's past it's past the N64 days, so it can't really be called Super Mario 64 2. It'd have to be called some like Super Mario paintings. I don't know. Super Mario 3D paint. I don't know. But like, if I can't really go back to like Super Mario 64, but like they could go back to Sunshine. I love to see Sunshine because there's a lot of like. Islands in there where we haven't explored. Okay, let's just do this. Oh, thanks. There's more human in there than you think. Is that really it? I'm so happy you made me free! I think that's what he said anyway. I kind of skipped it far too quickly. Okay, and now. Oh, we're only at the halfway point? Some holiday. Some holiday! Cuckoo's! Sank his area's frozen! Durn! Oh, my! I didn't even see that! I've been I'm working hard on this mission to help you find a star! Oh look, there's a star from there! Yep, yeah, and you're no longer! Okay, well apparently this is a longer mission than I thought. Like, I knew this was a... Oh wait, I think we're at the end anyway. I think this part just wasn't memorable at all. <laughs> Honestly. Unless there's this whole underground section, which I can't really see happening. Um, I don't really remember what we're doing at the moment, if I'm completely honest. But okay, I'm just, I'm just gonna take out all these guys in case that's what we have to. 
Guys, I want you to type in the comments if you're watching up to this point. Those enemies are a complete and utter troll. But yeah, um, I could see him going back to Sunshine. I know people could probably say, oh, I can't see him go back to Sunshine because it's been too long. But at the same time, I went back to Luigi's Mansion. We've even made an arcade game and all by Luigi's Mansion. I know I'd really love to see a Luigi's Mansion 3. Even, I love, I love actually the Luigi's Mansion 2. Um, way of doing probably more than Luigi's Mansion 1 because, in my opinion, it had far better replayability in, in 2 instead of 1. But I wouldn't be disappointed if it did go back to like the first, the first game's mechanic because that was obviously a really good game. The only problem with number one, which also did make it a bit more replayable, I guess, was the fact that you know. It was um and it was far too short, but that did make it more replayable for other people because they did. It. Holy co oh, okay, there is a dark mold. I I thought so really confusing. It's like really, it's just gonna be a big section here. Rip my life, honestly. Rip my life. Okay, all right. It's just, oh no. How do I actually battle these guys? I forgot how I battle these- Oh! Alright, is this a butt bounce? Alright, oh, well these guys are easier than I thought they would be. Okay, well... Oh! Really, is that it? Is that the end of the level? Okay, well... I don't know why- Why did I say okay, like, okay... And is this just gonna bring us to the top? Okay, well... Oh, where's the drill? Where's the drill I need? I'm like, <laughs> I love the way I'm still doing the puzzles because I honestly, I haven't really played this game in full since my, um, I first played in like 2010, except for the race because the race is like that, was like that, but honestly the race was in like the span of like two years, so I haven't played this part of the game in like two years, so give me a break. Two years? Jesus. I can remember doing this level as well two years ago. Unless I was for green stars and you had to go very far for that level to get the green star, but... Woo, holy crap. I'm sorry, that's just giving me a bit of a blast of past there. Oh, really? I think we're seven star bits off. Don't do that to me. Hmm, it says we penguins aboard a spaceship. That's a new one on me. Well, he seems to want to work with you, but I can't give out one way. Ah, uh, he's probably going to give us hints and swimming. Come on, wish me luck. I'm not sure which one will actually been better since I need seven star bits, which is just disappointing. But honestly, I think I can get seven star bits really easily on the not the combat of Sarbatory rip rip rip. Don't the <laughs> memory please. Like up here, come on, there we go. Honestly, only one star bit per fruit? Wow. Come on now. Holy crap. Oh no, I thought that was the last bit of friend. I'm like, holy crap. How coincidental is that? Okay, we're gone. But we're up to 27 lives. Apparently between sessions doesn't matter. I know I didn't switch off the Wii U during la bef between this session and the last session. Oh, there's another star bear. Okay, we'll feed this hungry limb anyway. And then we'll go for a back for the other one because it'll be easy to do. It'll be really easy to do. That next mission. Let me see how long's on timer. We're 14 minutes. Okay, this is not gonna be a short level at all episode at all. Ha! <laughs> I love the way people who are probably listening at the start are like, oh it's gonna be a short episode. Probably it's gonna be the longest in the series now that I look at it. Cause because we're only like halfway star wise for it, and it's like 14 minutes in the timer. Depending on how long this level is, let me have a look. Do I remember? No. Well, I'll probably remember once I see my name. But we'll see it after the final Cosmic Cove secret star. Okay, that's how you put it. So, okay. Also, I'm surprised because we, I'm surprised that we haven't saw anything about comets yet. Comets yet. So I'd expect, I would have expe honestly expected to see a lot more by now. Well, now we have gotten a lot more star bits. <laughs> now we've got more in our adventure now than we do at Starship Mario. 
Okay. Do these guys drop coins? Let me see. No. Oh. Let me see, but we can get a few more star bits at least. Ha! <laughs> Okay, I don't think it'll be too hard to get coins if I'm completely honest. I just got a coin. What was that? Mm. I, was, I was in the middle of saying, what was that launch? Like, holy crap. Like, why was that? Why am I getting such big launches from her? I'm not complaining though. Oh, okay. You can't do that. Pro tip, you can't do that. <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay, actually, you know, I think, but I think there's a lot more, you know. But, wait, may I say how awkward swimming is until you get a shell in this game? I'm not sure if I was on purpose or not, but it's really awkward until you get a shell. Oh, and by the way, that's not how you get out of this, are you? And now I will have to do the awkward swimming. But we got a lot more star bits, and I got to show off another part. But yeah, as always, let's go here for, you know, coin. Um, bubbles for air and coins for air. Coins don't give as much air, I believe, as um, the bubbles. Bubbles fully restore your air, no matter what, and I believe, like, coins do half air. And here we go. Have we already got 15? Once we do this, no, what happened? It's like 14. Oh god. Holy crap, can I aim? Please, 14. Um, seriously, look how awkward this is. I know this is also me doing really badly of controls. But honestly, come on, bruh. Bruh! Bruh! Like, come on. I'm. I'm not the biggest fan of swimming in this game at all. We need one more coin. We'll freeze. I'm freezing this lake ASAP. I don't need to freeze the lake anymore. <laughs> okay, now we can feed in 15 coins. As you can see, extremely easily. And you don't really need the coins for anything in this game. Well, there's one thing, but it's not the best thing in the world. Uh, it's in Starship Mario. Spoiler. And uh, what's up here? I guess I'm going to summon to do a freezing because that looks like it's just a wee thing of water. There has to be a bit of. Yeah, okay, there's a button. Oh, I know exactly what this is. So you can catch me? I'd like to see you try. So, yeah. Obviously, you go really slow here on this. You go normal speed at ice, but as soon as you spin, you go fast, I guess you could say. Is what you say. And there we go. Easy mission. Easy, easy, easy. Okay, cough me. Here, take this. Boing, 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 Rip. It was like me and like Bowser's Inside Story. I always thought they're goblins, but they're globins. Like hemoglobin, but was, I, I always thought it was like hemoglobin. Because I was like far too young to understand that. And now I, if I've done itchy for GCSE and God be in it, I know it far too well. <laughs> Honey Bloom Galaxy. Okay, I think I remember this one. Actually, no, I do. I do. I do remember. I do remember it. I spent far too long on it in the race. Okay, I love why I always say to myself, I'm not going to talk about the race. And then I start talking about, you guessed it, the race. Mm -hmm. Bumble beginnings, oh my god, why? <laughs> why? I don't know why I'm actually talk. I don't know why the hell I'm like talking like this during like the last plan. It's far better because it's probably what's like better like for the channel and all as well which is good but i think it's because like i haven't been able to record any time you know on my own i also like a game i'm extremely passionate to play in a long time like i don't know what the last game was except for you know stream streams i've like been playing games i love more but like i haven't been able to do like any solo streams and also those are like at bad times for me because it's a night and families are and i'm not allowed like talk as loudly because they're all sleeping and uh, let's go back this way 
But yeah, this is so much fun to do. I don't know why. I'm, I'm starting to get back into that. I think it's because like I've been doing other videos and Let's Playing, like I said earlier on, like this Let's Play. I don't know how long ago it was. Probably about five episodes by this point. Hi, hi, can you find? Now I've got Bean Mario because we used the Bean Mushroom. If that's not the name of the uh, mushroom, I will put it in the beautiful um, annotation. But I'm pretty sure it is just called the Bean Mushroom. I don't know why, this is so much fun to record. It's like, it's just like whenever I recorded Super Mario Sunshine, I recorded it all in one day. I even recorded a post game for it and I still haven't uploaded the post game. But one thing I'm really happy about is the fact that... Oh no! That was just mean! I was like, oh, the common mail's really easy to get and just before I said that, I failed at getting the common mail. That's what you call rip, is that's just a definition of a rip. In many, many pieces. <laughs> but yeah, it's so weird getting back into an actual Let's Play. Like, I loved Web of Shadows, don't get me wrong. And I did lo love, um, well, I didn't love um, Ace Attorney. But Ace Attorney was not a Let's Play, it was more of a walk through words. But like, yeah, whenever I say walk through words, obviously I was a let's play, but like, instead of, you know, we're being like commentary and all, it was like all, all of my commentary was so un, like, creative and all, which sounds like really weird for me to say, but like, it was more all like, just, oh yeah, that's another thing I want to show off. If, oh, I hope I don't kill myself while doing this, but okay, if you jump on these things here, you gain, um, your fly meter up a wee bit. Also, spamming and works so well, so as you saw how much air time I discover. Also, yeah, you want, whenever you land, you want to make sure that the thing is full before you fly. Unlike what I just did. God. But yeah, um. Uh, if you watch my Ace Attorney, it was basically all of my um, commentary was me reading out dialogue. And that's why Ace Attorney was really delayed, because I just wasn't passionate to do it. Like, that was probably the hardest Let's Play I've ever had, to go just go hitting the record, but record button. And that was just because, you know, if it, it was a fun Let's Play to do, don't get me wrong. But it just wasn't a, a Let's Play, you know, you, you were extremely passionate, but I was like, oh, here I'm gonna go and play this game and just read out the dialogue. Instead of this, where I'm able just to talk, I know I'm not really saying anything interesting. It's because I don't, I don't really have anything interesting to say. But at the same time, it's just really fun to do, and it's just something you can just sit back and enjoy. And like, I can't talk about my channel stuff a wee bit and all here. Instead of like Ace Attorney, where I'm like, okay, I'm, I the most commentary I got was legit in like the first five minutes of a session, because if you watch the Ace Attorney, you've known all my lads play parts is fitted together like I would have cut on a, a weird part at the end of an episode and then the next episode would have resumed maybe even from um, the last line or so from the thing from the last episode and then nothing really else would have been said and all and, and I'd be like okay well sorry but uh, 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 usually sorry hey guys Craig here welcome back to some more Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney in the previous episode we did this, and before we start off I want to say blah blah blah, okay, sorry about the delays, because I, I said that so so much during our Let's Play, and then, um, yeah, let me see, it's our secret star nest, because honestly, it's actually a secret star in our level, because I swear to god I saw another star, let me check, is there? Yes there is, okay, well I'm going to be going back into this with no idea where I'm going on this. And I don't want... It's 25 minutes, okay, this is the longest la episode in this last play so far, I find. Uh, I'm, but I don't know at all where I'm going. It's a problem. Which makes me think that I'm not going to, like, show off. I'm going to maybe play for you so we bet. And I saw where the star was, and it's about halfway through the level. I saw the star and that's why I thought, and I just never first saw them from us. Okay, let me see what's fully down here, because I only went to one side and I didn't like doing any of this. Okay, this is just a pit you fall down. 
Okay, well, apparently I didn't even have to come down here and this is just the way out of summer you went into. Whoops. Shows how much I know this level. Oh, this is the part I'm nervous about because I've got no idea where I'm going. No idea at all. As soon as I find the star I, I saw, I am probably am just going like cut to whenever I get to the secret star. Although I, I do believe it's going to be really easy to find now if I'm looking for it. So I believe it'll just be in this like wee strip here for some reason. It's just that feeling you've got because this one feels like there's so much stuff you can miss. Also, yeah, the star is just there, as you see. Let's see, and I fell. Okay, oh, what's up here? Um, I'm going to be right back once I find out where I'm going. All right, well, I'm swinging backwards and forwards here and I saw this, and let me see. Is this the way I'm going? I'm actually not sure. Um, I walked back away basically and that's how I got to here if this is the right way I'm not sure. Oh it is! Holy crap that was an absolute gamble by the way I just had to put out there. So there we go got the secret star here I've got five stars this episode holy moly. That is really good in my personal personal opinion. And we've probably got a wee bumblebee who's joined our merry gang on board the starship of Mario. So let's see, have we got 150 star bits, 319 coins. Looks like we've got be on board. Keep away from me, I'm allergic. If I get stung, I'll swell right up. I don't know why I find that one funny. I do like watching him though. You think he knows how he could be tricks? Hmm, is that a hint to go talk to him and learn about more about the bee suit? And let me see, is this going to be a one-up mushroom? Yes, it is. We're almost up to 30 up. So, with that, thank you guys all for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And hopefully, see you guys all next time. We'll go find out is this a letter from Princess Peach, which I think it is? Or is that an important piece of meal? Oh, we'll find out in the next episode. So, hopefully, see you guys all then. Bye.